A baby and a bush. Egypt was filled with Israelites. The new Pharaoh was afraid that the Israelites would become too powerful, so he made them slaves and treated them very badly. <laughs> Pharaoh ordered that all baby Israelite boys had to be killed. One woman put her baby in a basket and hid him by the river's edge. His sister watched him. Did Pharaoh make the Israelites slaves? Because he thought they were becoming too weak. Pharaoh's daughter was bathing by the river. She found the baby and decided to keep him. His sister offered their mother's help to care for him. Pharaoh's daughter named him Moses. Moses grew up. One day, he saw an Egyptian beating an Israelite. Moses killed the Egyptian. Then he fled to Midian and was a shepherd for forty years. <laughs> Moses was watching his sheep on Mount Horeb. The voice of God spoke from a burning bush. My people are suffering, Moses. I have chosen you to free them. I can't, Moses cried. I'll help you, God promised. Throw down your staff, Moses did. It turned into a snake. When he picked it up, it was a staff again. How did God speak to Moses? Put your hand in your cloak, God said. Moses did. He looked. It was covered with disease. When he did it again, it was healed. Show Pharaoh that, God said. I'm not a good speaker," said Moses. "I'll give you the words," God said. "Your brother Aaron can help." So Moses went to tell Pharaoh to set the Israelites free. <laughs> Meh. 
God promised to help Moses when he went to tell Pharaoh to let the Israelites go. True or false? Thank you.